to my unboxing and first look at the Tyranid Malanthrope. I was requested to get hold of one and I've managed to get my hands on one. Um, it's in this little box here. One of these will cost you £55. It's a fair amount of money. It's quite an impressive looking uh, model. Um, so without further ado, let's just jump on in there. Um, I even forgot I had this one. Um, it's just been sat in the back of the drawer for a while. I was going to pick this up at the Warhammer 40,000 uh, open day um, a couple of months ago, but I didn't. So I used my free voucher for this, the free shipping voucher for this. Um, so let's have a look. It's just a little bag. That's all it is. Just a little, it's just one bag. That's it. Um, I can't remember when this model first came out, but um, it's here. And this is not part of Nidvember. We're a long way off. Uh, you get uh, a very, very detailed um, instruction manual. <laughs> Honestly, that is it. <laughs> we, we're spoiled, aren't we, with our plastic kits? We really are. Um, so you get this really detailed base. Um, loads of like uh, just rocks and things on there. So you don't actually get a you know proper sort of base. I might put this on a proper base though. So. Uh, that's what that is. That's all um, uh, detailed and things. And then you get this, which is obviously like the tail. Um, fair bit of detail, just like with the uh, Dimachiron. Uh, you get a little hole there, and that's where you put the, the uh, sort of um, transparent rod in. Loads of tubing and things. Um, so there you go. And then you get just the guide. This was checked. Uh, I don't even know what that number is. A 20th of 26th. If you're any good with numbers, just tell me what that is, okay? Um, then you've got the head. Very sinister looking alien kind of head with these uh, tendrils coming out. Or feeder, feeder tendrils, I want to call them. And then these kind of pointy long claws it's one long claw on each each hand little hand um and then this big uh body uh part of the uh the creature this is going to be very quite straightforward and quick and easy to uh create and build look at all the detail on there all these sacks and spikes a lot of detail on the ridges and the spikes on the top and all these sacks and tubing. Yeah, lots of detail there. I don't think the paint job sort of does it justice on the Forge World website, but uh, you know, mine's gonna be nice purple and light blue. And then finally you get some more, I wanna say digits, um, some more sort of claws and arms, um, not much more going on there. So yeah, that's all you get for your 55 pounds. Um, to me, that seems quite expensive. Uh, we'll see what happens once I've uh, glued it all together. Um, considering that you can get a, a Contemptor Dreadnought with both of his arms uh, for, I think about the same price. Uh, so, uh, or you can get a, uh, a Deimos pattern predator, which is obviously plastic and resin. Um, yeah, this seems quite quite expensive. I don't know whether they they bump the price up a bit, but uh, just looking at it, I'll probably spend about forty pounds on it, maybe forty five. But uh, but there we go. And then you get the two different uh, sort of uh, stands as well. It would have been nice if they could have moulded it um, and made it so that you could just have the the tail supporting itself like with the trigon but um no you're gonna have to use part of one of these uh to sort of prop it up um and glue it all in place but uh there we go uh like i said before i was asked to grab one of these and do an unboxing and review so this is the unboxing part of it i'm going to go away and build this and give you a review and go through all the rules because uh I think there was a recent FAQ in October, I want to say. It was definitely last year where they changed a few things for this Malanthrope. One of which changing the power points uh, cost from 10 down to 5. 
um, and this is a really great I'll go into the tactics and things of the model but this is a really great unit next uh, to sit next to like an exocrine or um, Tyrannofex or something like that that you want sort of shrouded um, anyway more on that in the review thank you ever so much for joining me today thank you for watching for the non-queen